Welcome back to the Irish Examiner's video diary from Pro-Am there here at FOTA, head of the Irish Open. Uh, Ambrose Guilfoyle is uh, alongside me and uh, we're here on the 10th tee box and uh, Ambrose, you look very official today. So what, what, what's your job? My job actually is I'm a sector controller for holes 10, 11 and 12. Uh, and we have three hole captains then appointed as well. And it's basically just to make sure that, they, you know, that everything runs smoothly and that everybody is happy. Well, we've been here since early morning, and I must say it has been running like clockwork. Oh, it has been fantastic. Uh, we left home this morning at quarter past six, and we all assembled at quarter to seven. And the lads have been down the fairways and on the greens and had very little break, but everybody's great spirits. The weather's superb, and it's a great thing for Cork. Certainly a great thing for Cork. Great mood, as you said. I must say, the the pros, as much as the amateurs, seem to be absolutely loving it. Ah, yeah, the pros are fantastic. Well, today is the day for the pros, really. Tomorrow it gets serious, uh, and everybody that came on the tee box today was great with everybody around and um, signed autographs spoke to everybody so yeah I think it's going to be a great few days here in photo to be quite honest as you said it gets serious on yeah. Thursday I presume the same applies for you you have to take it up a notch or two yeah well we've got to be more careful uh, you know the way people move around the course and that th these guys aren't upset because it's about rider pints rider cup pints for them and it's big money so we'll just make sure it goes well and it runs smoothly Massive volunteer effort for something like this. Superb, really is. Um, there are so many guys involved in this that it, it's a great credit to all the clubs in Cork and it's, it's made up of club members from around the city and county and it's just people that love golf and, and are giving their time freely for it. And I presume you're predicting massive crowds over the next couple of days? I think if this weather continues, um, the crowds were going to be big but they'll be far bigger I think with the sunshine.